progenitor of who you call the Africans today. Right. They were the ones who enslaved us, who captured us and put us on the slave ships. You know that saying that they taught us in school that our people put us into captivity? I'm listening. Go ahead. I hear a lot of but, stuff. Okay. White people put, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I'll, no, it, it's a, yes, sir. It's a yes, circle. Sir. I, no, I, I got you. I didn't hear it in school, but I heard it through one may say this great fire. Okay, well, what you need to understand is we are not Africans. We don't come, and, and those Hamites are not even Africans. <laughs> if you want to be technical, Con. they come through the bloodline of Ham. And Leo Scipio Africanus is, was, a, it was a white uh, general in Rome. He conquered that land and named it after him, after himself. He was a white man, a so-called oh, white uh, man. Somebody get Psalms. Uh, yeah, please, know. please get that they, for me. They named their It's 49, 49, 11, 11 Con. Yeah, huh? Yep. To so that. we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna bring that out to get you to understand something. And matter of fact, I'll get my book out real quick to point this out to you. Yeah. Hey, you want me to read it now? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead, I'm read it. Go ahead, I'm gonna ask you another talk. question. Psalms 49 verse 11. The inward thought is, that their houses shall continue forever in their dwelling places to all generations. Now, now what that verse is saying, that their inward thought is that their houses will continue forever. Now, every nation that has risen, Egypt, Babylon, Rome, the Assyrians, anyone you, any nation that has risen up, have they not fallen? Well, I agree with that, yes. So, it, do you think America is going to continue on forever? No. But okay, gonna, as long as you agree on that. Yeah, okay. You know? well, let me ask you another question. Go ahead. Because we talked about everybody is dark. Started off, everybody started dark. Yeah. Here's, a, here's another thing. Definition of oh. dark. Because we have different shades. Brown. So That's now, right. All right, so now, and, and the Negro, according to the Latin, okay, according to the Latin, the word Negro is very dark. So our, so we're talking shades of darkness. Or, of I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ask this question. All right. I ain't trying to uh, throw no curves. Or are we talking spiritual darkness? No, there is no there is no spiritual darkness. Okay, all right, cool. All right, now, <laughs> now you said everybody dark. Okay, you said African, and I know us people over there are black as shit. Okay, next. Okay, here's the here's the reality. Here's the reality. Okay, all right. So everybody's dark. Now the darker ones are sub-Saharan for sure. Okay. Make that distinction because okay, everybody because knows that there are different bloodlines. That's what you have to understand. Or lighter than, uh, now, let's let me, say, spit. Let me let me bring the, let me bring this back to Genesis then, because you know the name Adam. Do you know what the name Adam means? I heard the great vine it means dirt of black of the ground. Dirt. Okay, see, yeah, yeah, hey, look. But, hey, so is uh, so is sand. Hey, hey look, hey, hey look. You want to say something? So no, basically, the word Adam sure. means of the ground, like you just said. Sand. At least he knows it is sand. spirit. Sand. Sand. So sand. what color? Down. You know the color of the ground is is of a dark color. It's it a different sand. shade. Sand. 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 These sand. brothers are of a different sand. shade of brown, basically. Yeah, let me. Yeah, yeah, let me so, say this. So, so, there is no I, such I'm thing as black. Shades. I'm listening to the shades. Okay. Now those are titles. Those yeah. are titles that yes, are put on us. That's what you have to understand. The word Ethiopian, in which the brother has Spirit there in the dictionary, because I didn't forget about that. The word Spirit Ethiopian Spirit. goes back to the it. Greek word Ethiops, which means what? Go ahead and read it. Which just read it for edification. Standard international dictionary, regular dictionary, common dictionary. The word Ethiop, which is archaic adjective, Ethiopian, Negro, Black, and Ethiopian is from the Latin, Ethiops, Greek, burnt face. Now, now you want to know why? Because the Romans, now, but, but you want to understand, and what you want to understand is the Romans had, had uh, mistaken us for Ethiopians. We'll stick with the word Latin, okay? Um, you don't let them fool you. All right, I wish y'all were. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, once again, I mean, once again, hey, man, look, that go to show you, man, that's the spirit that's on our people because he knew certain things, man, but he's a bug out, man. But once again, this is for edification of the, of the camera. Con. Teeth was wiggling and shit about to fall out at any given moment, man. Our people are fucked up, man. Yep. Saw his children. The Lord will smite you with blindness and madness. And astonishment of the heart. heart. Yeah, yep. 
It is a spiritual darkness too. Yeah. Right? Kind. Yeah, it is yeah. spiritual. Darkness. Oh yeah, yeah, you know what? And you know what? So water for correcting me on that. Though. He's going on the word though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's what it meant, you know. Yeah. So water for correcting me on that, but but like I said, he had it in, in his own interpretation. Yeah. You know. <laughs> uh, this is Isaiah 22 and 17 it says, "Behold, the Lord will carry thee away with a mighty captivity, and will surely cover thee." He will surely violently turn and toss thee like a ball into a large country. There thou shalt die, and there the chariots of the glory shall be the shame of the Lord's house. And that's that's all of our captivities, man, like this brother brought up earlier. You know, it wasn't just you no know, uh the, the so-called Negroes just coming over here in slavery. But if you if you uh, have seen that movie 1492, you will see how they tortured the, the uh West Indian uh, uh, the people over there in the West Indian Islands. And, and, and then uh, later on with, the, with Gad and all that stuff throughout history, period. They were torturing them, bringing them back and forth over there to Portugal and Spain. Matter of fact, and just for edification, if people don't know, the first actual so-called Negro slaves came out of Portugal and Spain. No, those were the Moors who were under that philosophy and doctrine, uh, that, that, that uh, bullshit Muslim doctrine. Yeah, they were the interpreters yeah. for the for the uh, people living in the West Indian Islands that spoke Hebrew. Yep. Right. It's uh, Zechariah 11 and 4. Thus said the Lord that God feed the flock of the slaughter, whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. Yep, and, and who's our, who's our uh, possessors? Possessors, yeah, right. That's Esau, man, and he, and he slayed us. Right, like he said, 1492, man, that's a good movie. Because well, well, what we were getting into, the first guy, okay, and, and uh, the brother said it behind the camera, that it's not just a, it's not just a so-called Negro thing, yeah, man. Yeah, all black thing. And you got a lot of people pre preaching that vibe, man, all right? And then they say it's a color thing. We, we don't preach color, we preach nationality, all right? That's right, seed of it, your father. It, it's, yeah, it's the seed of your father. So you're going to have different shades, all right? You're going to have people that look uh, like so-called white people. All right, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a good example of that, you know? I might have features of, of a so-called white person, but that don't mean I'm I'm a I'm Esau. I don't come from the line of Esau because my father, all right, is from the uh, is from the tribe of Ephraim, all right. From what I know, so it's not a color thing; it's a nationality thing. That's right. And also, you know, and, and with these brother spirits, if they really were not, uh, uh, if the Most High wasn't dealing with them, you would know if they were not of the of the bloodline of Israel, they would not be standing out here with us. Right. Yeah. Who, who the hell would believe that? <laughs> yeah, I, I definitely know I'm from the tribe, all right? I'm definitely know I'm from the 12 tribes. Now I'm just enduring, all right, to be a the elect, all right? Right. That, 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 that's what it comes down to, all right? When you, you, you come into this truth, all right, and then you endure until the, until the end, all right? And, say, and if, you're, if you're the elect, you know, it'll be, it'll be made known. Yeah, like that one dude, he said, oh, he's been called, he's been called. Yeah, it's good exactly. to talk about many are called, but few are chosen. Right, well, he, right. He, he, he made, so a, good, we, we he made a good point. Oh, it's talking. No, go ahead, go ahead. No, he made a good point. He said, you were called, you were, yeah, we, all, we are all called, yeah, man. All called. But that don't mean we're chosen, and we, we recognize that there. Yeah, he may have been called, but that don't mean he was chosen, because why? Because he's not doing the work. That's the main, and we should have got there about the faith, all right? It's, it's about the works, man. Yeah, he can say, oh, I know this, I know that, but he ain't doing no work. And that's that's what it's all about, man. Doing the work, and it, when you come in this thing, just just as much as holding the sign is doing work, man. Coming out here week after week and holding a sign is doing work. All right, building yourself up to be a, to to a level to be all right, a teacher to, to actually preach. All right, yeah. hold precepts. You know, it, it, like 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 the scriptures say, it's all one body, man, and we all have our part. Yeah, precept, real quick. It's uh, Hosea seven and eight. Ephraim, he hath mixed himself among the people. Right, and that, that's a prophecy on Ephraim. He hath mixed himself among the people. Go ahead. Ephraim is a cake not turned. That's right, and, and Ephraim, man, the Puerto Ricans are heavy into, into having sex with white women. There's nothing wrong with that, right? That's not the fucking mark of the beast, right? as you assholes are saying that sleeping with a white woman is the mark of the beast. The child, okay, when he comes out, it's going to come out Ephraim, all right? Even if it does have characteristics of a so-called white person. Now, if the father, all right, is a so-called white person, has sex with a Puerto Rican woman, then the child